Hello everyone, I am Adrish Mitra and I am a former trainee at Indian Cyber Security Solutions and this is a video tutorial on Nmap so let's get started so before starting Nmap uh, I'm going to show you some parameters which you need to know so first one is T which is time template uh, it enables you how fast you want to complete your scan the accuracy of scan report also depends on that so t5 completes the scan in the shortest time while t0 uh, completes the scan in longer time aggressive scan provides you with all kinds of reports uh, like operating system and verbosity all parameters are included separately can be included separately PN is no ping. The inclusion of this parameter, the IP address which you are scanning uh, will not be pinged. So, pinging is basically uh, getting information that whether the system is uh, connected to the network and responding uh, or not. Okay. Script uh, this is the script vulnerability uh, parameter which uh, shows that whether uh, the system or the target IP address uh, is uh, vulnerable to any kind of uh, preloaded scripts or uh, exploits so this is how we write a command so I'm going to show you some of the commands like nmap spsv and cid and notation of the IP address so I have an example here nmap show this is ping sweep and this is the show version parameter and this is the CID and notation will show you the uh, list of devices which are connected to the network means which you are connected presently so and this is the script vulnerability thing which was talking about so without wasting too much time we are going to see implement it okay so i am using vmware workstation and i have two operating systems one is backbox which uh, operates on a linux kernel and this is my window xp machine target machine so nmap uh, facilitates you to perform a remote scan on any ip address uh, of the uh, on the network to which you were connected you can perform a remote scan and gather information which operating system or what kind of uh, machine it is you just need the IP version for address of the machine okay, so let's get started so in this case I know the IP version for address uh, 192.168.0.105 okay so first of all I'm gonna write okay uh, we're gonna sudo nmap uh, just a second one ninety two dot one sixty eight dot zero one zero five and we're gonna see what happens so nmap itself is a command okay so this is starting in map okay so just if you write nmap and the target IP address you will be able to see what kind of services are running and uh, open ports you can discover open ports and the MAC address of the machine target machine so this is what basic nmap nmap itself is a command uh, and this is what a remote scan does it provides you information uh, about a target machine whichever machine you want to scan okay so i'm going to show you how to see the number of devices connected so we're going to write nmap tac sp which is the ping swip and s v and the target ip address which is 192.168.0 uh, 
dot one zero five and we're gonna hit enter okay so if you don't write the CID and notation it's gonna initiate a scan on your machine and it's gonna show that it's gonna show the report on your machine so I'm gonna write the CID and not CID and notation which is IP address slash 24 number of host okay so these are uh, the list of machines like 192.168.0.1 uh, and these are the IP addresses which are scanned and which are active uh, presently connected to the network uh, so you can uh, see and this is one thing you can do uh, next thing I'm gonna which, which I'm willing to show you is uh, let me see okay I uh, it also provides the MAC addresses of the devices which are connected so uh, SP okay let me write SP and SV 192.168.0 dot one zero five okay okay I missed the CIDA part okay so see uh, previously when we didn't have the root user access uh, nmap showed me just the IP addresses and we didn't know which machine it was so now we also have the MAC addresses of the machine D-Link International this is a router which is connected and these are the uh, systems this is the VMware okay uh, and see this is the scan report to this IP address is scan so this is how nmap uh, you can uh, detect anything and let me show you another thing which is nmap you can write nmap again and include sudo okay let me switch to root user first that's not cool okay so I'm in root user mode and I'm gonna write nmap slash uh, SV slash V and 192.168.0.1 105 okay so the parameter V okay this is okay so this is the version uh, see this is the service info service information which show version shows and uh, verbosity this is how nmap works like discovered open port and whatever it does verbosity report shows that so this is how we work on nmap we you can customize your scans uh, include several other parameters so thank you for watching this video I hope it has been helpful. And uh, for people who are starting careers in ethical hacking and other networking uh, uh, jobs, uh, NMAP is very important. And reading the scan report is another important thing. So, thank you again.